Coach Fry joins us after a great weekend at the Armory. Gamecock women finish in first place and the men take second. Overall, Coach, I know you're extremely happy with how everybody performed up and down the lineup. It was a great weekend for you guys. Yeah, it was an outstanding weekend. We're just so happy to come out of here healthy. Um, that's a big thing coming into a meet two weeks in a row, running really tough competitions. But the big thing is our kids took on the challenge and took on great teams. You know, Ohio State is a great track team. Arizona is a great track team. Wisconsin is a great track team. Oklahoma are a great team. So the win of meet with those persons in the meet uh, makes us feel good about ourselves. Uh, getting ready to go in uh, one week left before we go into our conference meet. And uh, for our guys to finish uh, second without um, having, with TT false starting, which hurt a little bit, and then having um, having uh, Josh in a shot put, you know, with a cold this week, and we had to hold out uh, uh, Mike in the triple jump. So we felt like, you know, you know, as our meet, uh, we could have won both. We didn't realize that coming in, but we're just happy to be in a meet of this size and compete that well. What does it do uh, for the women's team and really the entire program to win a meet like you guys did? From a confidence standpoint, i got to think that uh, shoots through the roof. I think the confidence is high, uh, but our kids are excited. Our big thing is still picking up kids that got to have a lot of confidence. We've got to be striking on all cylinders for the SEC championship. To get into the top ten in the SEC, it's going to take a Herculean performance from us and our kids are picking up those numbers. And those little small uh, things are gonna make the big difference. And here in this meet, uh, to get uh, Aisha and uh, Tanisha uh, running well in the hurdles, that was just a, a step in the direction of, of small numbers that we have to have in the SEC Championship to help us move into the top 10 in the SEC. And then uh, hit our way toward top 15 in the country. So there are just things that happen well for us this week.